That's a quite populated layout. Oh, there is an office here. Interesting. There are laptops, chairs, shelves, and so on. What's here? Oh, there's even a printer here. That's very interesting. There is also some kitchen shelves, some walls, some bridges. I wonder how we can find these facilities in ECAD. Well, Reza is here. Welcome. Let's talk about factory facilities in Visual Components ECAD. What I'm talking about is the folder starting with facilities. Oh well, folders, there is more than one. There is the facilities for robots. So these are some robot controllers as you can see and accessories. There is also interior stuff, the chairs, the printers and so on, tables. And last but not least, the factory facilities, which are doors, fences, walls, and so on. I'm just naming them on the go. Let me clean this layout and see what do we have there. I would try now a couple of these components. For example, this skyline and then the stairway. There is also sky bridge. So maybe I would just quickly... With holding down control, double click there. Let's connect this skyline over there. And then, as you can see, the geometries are updating automatically. So, some skyline like this. Then, what do we have? Then, oh, we have this rolling steel door as well. This, I guess, this one has some interfaces, right? Or maybe some signals. Yeah, there are some signals here. So if I press play, let's say up and down. Oh, the door is opening. So you can connect basically signals here and start using this door when people are going and coming. And what else do we have? Let me just turn off the signals. We also have, well, factory halls. That's nice. So we could populate it like that. Let me delete the door. And then I would also, last but not least, I would use the fence builder. This is one of my favorite components, so you can create fences around your areas, however they are required. And then we can follow such. Let's press populate. And there we have. So I could also delete this and each fence is also parametric so you can start to modify them how you wish so. And then when the fence builder is not needed I would just delete it. But for example this fence I could just change the fence height like this with pressing down and up arrow or then change the fence stand like that. Okay. That's what I wanted to review. Feel free to explore the facilities on your own. Have a good one and see ya.